Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. I am here on a plane heading to Orlando, Florida with Anya. And uh, yeah, I'm competing this weekend at the Clash. How exciting! So, yeah. so I am currently one day out from the Clash Championships here in Orlando, Florida. I'm very excited. I'm also nervous. As you guys know, I kind of had a little, I don't know, difficulty with this prep getting like completely 100% in the zone. And it's like really hard for me to like push it. Um, you know, I, I'm really good at staying 95% intensity all year round, but that last like extra 5% was so difficult to get into that headspace this time. Um, you know, sometimes when I'm really close to a show where I'm 100% in the zone, I'm like looking forward to cardio and I'm pushing it and the intensity is high. But I didn't really feel that so much this time until like the last week. And let me say something. This was the hardest peak week I've ever had in my life. I pushed it so hard and I don't usually go this hard during peak week. Usually I use peak week to relax and to recover and to just kind of let my body just rest. But I wasn't able to have that luxury this time, and it's all my fault. So I really pushed it this last week into peak week, and holy crap, glad that's over. I never want to do that again. <laughs> but with that being said, I did make a few adjustments with my posing, and I'm going to show you guys right now. So, you know, practicing my walk here and there's three different walks for three different areas, I guess you could say. Different walk when I'm walking from the side and the judges see me from the side. Different walk if I'm walking forward like this. And then, of course, a different walk if I'm walking back. So, now I have a habit of being super bouncy when I walk which isn't necessarily a bad thing, but if I'm walking from side or the judges see my side angle, I probably shouldn't be as bouncy as I am. I need to be more like smooth, more flat, more graceful, I guess you could say. So. Is that good? Looks really that. good. And then if I'm walking forward, I can definitely bring the bounce. Like that. And then if I'm walking back, this one's tricky. My butt cheeks aren't lame enough. <laughs> so if I'm walking back. No. Okay. It looks good. Okay. I feel like you see a lot of that this season with like the upper body movement when you're walking, like doing the back walk uh -huh. from just stage footage that I've seen. So like matching that with your arm movement, right. even having like a little more flow to your arms along with that. Okay. Because the walk looks really good. You have the hip angle down and you look very comfortable with it, like stable. Uh-huh. Okay. Can I so apparently, Anya says I'm a, a professional vacuumer. I didn't know this was a talent. <laughs> look at the waistline. Tiny. It's like, yeah, it's, you know, it's almost stage time. Didn't eat a lot today. 
I usually don't eat a lot during uh, like the day before a show because it's like you know in bikini get the smallest little waist possible and I don't want to be bloated on stage there's a bunch of like food so I just kind of eat light rice cakes sunflower seed butter coconut oil maybe one chicken and veggie meal but that's about it you know it's how, how I roll so it always feels weird like the first show of the season I just get so unsure with myself I'm like am I lean enough am I tight enough because it's almost like I forget how that actually feels so right now I'm like I'm like oh my gosh I don't know if I'm lean enough yet so hopefully my booty tightens by tomorrow <laughs> and also it like always kind of like is deceiving too when I'm in Florida it's like more humid less dry than um Vegas so my skin is softer so when my skin is softer I feel softer in general so I'm like oh my gosh am I am I not ready but we'll see tomorrow you know what regardless we gotta have fun and try out this new routine and um yeah it's a great way to start the season so whatever happens hopefully I'm okay with it <laughs> no I'm just kidding I I know that it's like every situation is different and every show is just like a blessing just to be on stage so I know I'll have fun regardless so yeah Keep you guys updated. All right, so time to go tan. I locked myself out of the hotel, so I'm gonna get another key as well. But yeah, let's get to, uh... oh, this fun this work. They say spray tans are worth like 10 workouts, so I'm hoping I'll be stage ready by the time I get this tan, so I'll just go do my nails. We got to go tan. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna be cold. We will get tan. It's always so cold in the tanning rooms, yeah. so it sticks, which is also here in in so so flow so flow right so flow so mm -hmm. Florida. It's so humid, makes the tan really hard to stick. So I had to get a little head start. If you guys know, already put on these clothes. So I just got done with my tan, and wow, my toes are numb now. Like I said, it's super cold in the tanning room. They want to keep us cold. That way the, the tan sticks better. Uh, but now I got to do my nails and I need these myself. These nails right here. Also, this is what I'm be wearing. I'm doing the press on glue situation. Um, usually I just get them done professionally and they stay longer. But you know what? I was like in a little bit of a rush. So, you know, that's how it is. And sipping on some tea, hot tea now because I'm cold. <laughs> Waiting for check-ins. Check-ins are about, uh, let's see, four hours or so. I'm going to stop eating here in about an hour so I can allow my body to uh, fast and digest everything that's in my stomach. Hopefully, I'll poop it all out tomorrow morning. But, yeah, other than that, I'm in pretty good mood as of now. Still a little tired, but we'll see. Tomorrow's, tomorrow's the day I need to not be tired. So, hopefully, my tiredness will allow me to sleep even longer go to bed early, sleep even longer for the show tomorrow. So pretty excited about that. And I also, uh, let's see, today I also did some posing with Anya. I don't know if you ever want to put your face in the vlog or not. <laughs> if you want to, that's her nails. <laughs> she's, she's camera shy. Um, but yeah, that was, that was a good, uh, little session we had there, Anya. So thank you. Yeah, of course. That. And uh, Adam likes the new little pose that you suggested too. The little Ooh, yay. profile back step thing. So, so cheers to that. I'm so confused. <laughs> I don't know where to go. This <laughs> just went. So we finally found the uh, check-in, athlete check-in here. So this is where I'm going to get my number. And this is the stage for tomorrow. That's a pretty awesome stage. It actually looks like good muscle lighting. Like it's gonna be very, um, the kind of lighting that makes your face look bad, but your body look good. <laughs> the opposite of the hotel lighting. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. So that's good, because I don't feel super, super lean. So this is gonna help me look leaner than I am, which I need help with this time. <laughs> I'm super hungry today. I'm not hungry usually, but oh my gosh, I'm so hungry today. I already ate all my meals, but I want more. I want more. Just gotta get through one day. Mm. And then post show salad. Mm. Be worth it. True, true. Very true. Let's see what we got tomorrow. Ah, yes, and a big poop tomorrow morning. 
Thank you. Yeah. Poop. <laughs> so I told Anya uh, to pray for my glutes tonight so that my booty be popping for the show tomorrow. We gotta pray for the booty gains. We pray for the booty be popping on stage. We pray for the glute thing, the hand pop. We pray to good God. Give Ashley K a round PG booty on show day. Amen. <laughs> that. That's a good teammate. You need to get yourself one of them. <laughs> we pray for the booty on show day. Yes, we do. Everyone pray for the for the glutes. So I just got back from check-in. It looks like I am number 236 tomorrow on stage. I'm done with the day. It is my favorite time of the day. I take out my hair extensions. I'm about to get in my pajamas. Put in a sloppy bun. Have a decaf coffee, maybe another rice cake or two. Wipe this makeup off my face and call it a day until tomorrow, which I found out that I'm not going on stage tomorrow till 11.30, so that's kind of awesome. That means I got a lot of time tomorrow to get my ish together. I, can, I don't have to rush doing my hair or makeup or tan or anything, so I can just, you know, go with the flow, which is nice, so. I think that's all up. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow.